Hey guys, what's up? Renji here. And I'm doing something a little bit different. I am doing a speed run on Tekkit. Now I noticed before that, um, I mean, I like doing commentaries on this and I also like to do um, playthroughs and everything. But I also like to do single player where I don't commentary and I don't um, do a specific thing the entire time. So this is my way of doing it without cheating. Because a lot of the times I will play this game and not really like not really play it very well. Like I'll play through it and then I'll get up to the point where I need diamonds and then I will just cheat and get diamonds. And I guess this is not really for you guys, but it's a way for me to play through and enjoy the game without really cheating. Because I mean, it's so easy to cheat. You can literally go into the um, into the options bar and search for the cheat thing, and just turn on cheat mode. And it's really easy to do it, just real quick. So, this is a way of me not playing like that. And I'm playing on Technic, which isn't something that I usually do. So it's going to be pretty interesting to see how that goes. Um, you'll see later how I how I play through and. Um, so yeah, it's it's good. Um, I'm still trying to get used to the Technic world of this. It's, I mean, it's just like fine down to a slightly different way. And actually, yeah, that sugar cane right there that I just hit. Um, I've never seen one up that high. I think it was five, no, four high. You can see in my quick bar. Wow, I've never seen um, four high. I thought it only went up to three, but I guess not. So I wanted to take it a little bit different. I know um, one of like there's small things like shift click will put items into your crafting bar and instead of your quick bar and kind of small things like that um, and I was looking around and I was trying to find a good place to start making stuff and I decided this place would actually be a pretty good place recently I've been trying to find out what I really want to do oh wait look <laughs> it took me forever to find out how to make a sickle so I had to actually search for it and yeah you see um it's so easy to cheat on this game. I didn't, and I ended up not cheating and taking anything out, so it's fine. Everything should be fine with that. Um, so yeah, I forget what I was saying right there. Yeah, tech technics a little bit different. You have a little bit more freedom on what you want to do, a little bit more specific on what you want to do. And I had a small problem finding out what I really want to do. So this is where I was like, well, I'll make a wizard's tower because I've always done. I've always done build craft. I've always done industrial craft and get the diamonds and then start a quarry and everything's right there. Um, get some solar panels and then just you're good from there on. But I decided, oh yeah, right here, you'll notice I went to sleep and I woke up and there was a furnace right there. It's because in the middle of the night I went down and I got some cobblestone and I forgot to turn on my recorder, my fraps again. So everything's perfectly fine. I really didn't cheat. If you were to dig up right next to it, you would see a huge pillar of wood next to a bunch of cobblestone. So it's perfectly fine. Um, another thing I wanted to make sure I start. I'm actually playing right now in hard mode, but I really don't want to be in hard mode. I really just wanted to be in like easy mode. I wanted there to be stamina involved, or you have to eat things, but I didn't want there to be too many monsters around. So I wanted, um, I wanted to be not really a challenge, but not really <coughs> like a sandbox. So that's why I had it on easy. But right now I'm playing on hard, just to have things going on. Um, yeah, I played once before on hard and I died right away. So I'm hoping this will go better. And <laughs> I was trying to find out what size I should make the tower, and I decided on um, uh, was it four by four, four by four? Yeah. So it's um, it's odd. Uh, there's a three by three with the corners to make it a little bit more circular. Now I'm thinking I'm gonna make a wizard's tower, and then just um, make a wizard's tower, and then do like a, a village kind of thing where I have a house for each separate thing. <coughs> and I'm thinking I'm going to make an arboretum. I think it's arboretum arboretum I think you'll see it right here when I search for it oh maybe later I don't know but an arboretum because that's one of the things that's specific to uh, Technic I am playing on 6.0.7 by the way it's a 
it's more like the earlier version of Technic. It's a little bit nicer to play, I guess. Um, one of the special things in it is the crafting bench Mark III. I know you can put it into the newer versions, but I am kind of lazy. Um, I always ran out of... One thing I like about Technic is that the forestry mod makes a huge difference. Um, I also didn't get the texture pack working. I got in, I realized all my texture packs were in the tech it and I haven't actually gotten to the Technic one. So it's just the normal version right now. Yeah, you can see here I'm making levels. Um, I, there are three high because I really don't like too high. I don't like to hit my head on the top. I like to be able to jump if I need to. And also I'll be putting machines in here. So that'll make a, that'll make a little bit different. I'm trying out something new, speed, um, speed crafting, I guess I should call it. Um, just playing the game really fast. And what this helps is that it helps me play more than, like I think I spent an hour and a half on it and then I condensed it down to around 15 or 18 minutes, I think. Let me see. Oh, I don't know. I can't see. 15, 18 minutes or something. And it makes it a lot more fun, at least for me, because I don't have to keep on talking and talking and talking. And also, I don't have to keep on making episodes, so it's really nice. I was thinking about making, like, a, a disc around the Mage Tower right here. And then I looked around and I thought it, it would take away from the mage tower, so I took it back down. But I didn't take it down too much because I was thinking about making um, a garden up here. And you can see me make a disc around. <laughs> now looking back at it, it looks a lot like a like a diving hoop thing that you would dive through into a pool. But <laughs> no, it's actually a garden. I was going to put some dirt in the middle and some water there. But... You'll see in here in just like a few seconds, I'll realize, oh, I don't really like it, and I'll take it back down. <laughs> yeah, I fell. I fell. I didn't have enough stamina. I didn't. I should have eaten a little bit more. But it's on single player, so it's fine. Yeah, so, um, I like to have, I want to put some water down in that hole so I don't fall all the way down and die again. But I, don't, I haven't remembered it yet. Yeah, you can see <laughs> Just fall off and die. Just fall off and die. So let me go ahead and pull this down real quick. Now I would have done um, slightly different here. I was going to have my laptop up and then have my other character play um, like a, an observer kind of thing and then play I don't know like a like a time lapse from third person not really first person like this but then I thought around for a minute it might be good for like a normal Minecraft but it wouldn't be good for tech it because um, a lot of the stuff that you do needs to be in third person you wouldn't really see everything that I would be doing in third person so that's why I decided to do um, do it in this kind. Now I know it is a little bit fast. I'm trying something new. I've never made one this fast before. I have played. I have made other ones, but none of them were ideal. I guess so this is the first one. I was like, oh, I want to play the game. I don't want to cheat, but I don't really want to. Oh, hi, fox. Um, <laughs> I found a fox. I wish you could tame them, but you can't. Um, but I locked them inside my house anyway. I was gonna make like a lighthouse thing. If you've ever seen a lighthouse before, they have a house next to it where the people live in. So I was going to make something similar to that. Um, I don't know. and But it didn't really work out the way I wanted it to. But I ended up keeping it anyway just for the heck of it. Um, I probably should have made the mage tower a little bit like, not really larger and not really taller. I am going to make, I am going to be making it taller though. Putting my bed up here so I don't like... I want to have a separate living space for it. There's the fox in here. Helping me. Helping me. Um. <laughs> I'm looking for fences, I think. I think it's fences. Yeah, it's fences. Um. Because I wanted to make, um. An area where I could go down into the basement and dig out some minerals, but I also didn't want to. I wanted to put the fox up somewhere so he wouldn't. Like. 
<laughs> you can see me right here trying to pull him into the little space over there. So I just blocked him off. <laughs> but I didn't really want him to run away, and I didn't really want to have him come around so I can punch him and then you get really mad at me because they are kind of mean. They will try to attack you if you hit them. So I didn't really want that to be a problem. <coughs> you can see right here I'm getting torches. I think I was getting ready to go down into the basement now to get some minerals. Yeah, he digs straight down. I didn't turn on any lights because I didn't think about it. <laughs> you can see me digging right there. <laughs> Actually, you really can't see me digging. Never mind. I don't like to get... Um, I have played Technic before, but that was <laughs> right when I decided I was going to cheat. And then just then I just quit after that because it was kind of boring. Because once I got diamonds, it was just like the whole thing. Go all game is ruined. So this is another reason why I play it like this. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I forgot to put a ladder right there. Um... I forget what I was going to say. Yeah, I was kind of scared about going down to that tunnel because I didn't know if there was anything around. I was playing on hard mode, so I was just like, is there anything around me or not? Yeah, and everything is, you don't have to worry about me taking the time to go mine. I mean, you see me go through real quick, just like that, even with a stone pickaxe. I'm going to turn up the brightness for next time. I'm also going to be playing, um, I might have it two times as slow. So it's like a half hour instead of 18 minutes like this one. I think it was 18. 18, 15. One of those. So I was gonna, first thing I usually do is go straight down to level 16. Just like anyone else usually does. So that was my main priority at this point in time. Um, I also wanted to get a furnace place, like a work area. Upstairs working. <laughs> I wanted to get... Um, yeah, because the texture pack hasn't really been loaded yet... Um, the iron furnaces and everything in Buildcraft and Industrial Craft don't really look how they're supposed to look with the Safax. I think you'll see here. I'll have to smelt up some iron first. <laughs> how, the, how did a rat get up there? I don't know. It must have been dark enough where things spawn. I don't know. Throw all my junk in there. I just want to take the iron out. No. No, that's later. Um, we could get some minerals. So yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's good. It's good. Um, it's definitely something where I will continue to do something like this. Um, this is just, I don't want to say first day, but it's the first part. And I might slow down sometimes when I'm building something a little bit more important, a little, something a little bit more tedious. But for right now, it's just digging and building, building my workshop. Yeah, I forgot to bring ladders downstairs, so I have to make some. And I was hoping I would have enough wood that I could. Not have to make a nerd pole back up. Uh, is it a nerd pole or a noob pole? I think it was a noob pole. No, nerd pole. I think it's a nerd pole. Um, yeah, I forgot to turn lights on for that too. Um, some nickelite. Which, surprisingly enough, I thought you would use more, but you really don't use nickelite that much. It's mainly for the alloy furnace. I was surprised. You can see here I found a um, trench. Trench, cavern, trench. No, it wasn't a cavern. What is that? Uh, ravine? Is there, I think it's a ravine. Yeah. But it's a lava ravine because there's lava there. <laughs> um, I wasn't too important. It wasn't too important to get things like tin yet. I mainly wanted to get copper. I know tin's important, but it's not as important as copper. Even though you still really do need it, I guess, to make anything like batteries and generators. Yeah. <laughs> Of course, I find two rubies, and that's about it. That's about all of the gems I find so far. I found gold, of course. I wish that would have been rubies, but whatever. Um, some coal. This is where... Oh, yeah, redstone. That's one of the other big things you need to make sure you get when you start out a new tech it, is a Just like a batch of redstone. You only need like 30 or 40 just to get started, but you really do need redstone. That's one of the first things I really, really try to get. <laughs> That's why I was really upset that the fox left. I guess he despawned. I was really upset about that. So I'm going to put some more iron in there. Sleep some. Yeah, um. <laughs> there's an ogre. <laughs> and this is where I realized I really didn't want to play on hard mode. I just wanted to play on easy. And for some odd reason, um, fences don't catch on fire, but they do. You don't see it. They catch on fire. That's why there's smoke everywhere. 
So yeah, I was I was kind of depressed about that. My whole my whole workshop was gone, and that yeah. So I ended up not keeping that little house next to it, which is fine. I mean, this is probably gonna where I, this is probably where I'm gonna keep the um, magic side of Tekkit, or I guess Technic at this point, or maybe the Thalmium. I guess I haven't really tested the Thalmium, so I might slow down my video to do some of that, because there's probably gonna be a lot of sitting around looking at Wikipedia and stuff. And that's where I think I switched it back to hard when I should have switched it to easy, but I didn't. And I don't know why. But I forget. I'll have to look at it next time. Uh, yeah, I wanted to make a junk chest and a normal chest. Yeah, there's Iron Furnace. You can see how it's not the um, not the actual Tekkit version. Er, it's not the, it's the fax version. It's the normal version. And I was a little bit depressed about that. I probably should have checked that before I started playing it. Um, I, I want to save a lot of the ore that I get for, um, for the macerator, so I don't waste it all smelting it. But, I mean, I also would like to have a quarry, so I can't get everything. Um, I think this is where I started to make, um, I don't really know what I was going to make here. I really don't know. Um, or was it? I think it was. Hold on, let's wait and see. Yeah, um, this is where I was going to make... I was going to have this be my um, storage house, I think, but I didn't really actually get to it, which is kind of awkward, I guess. Um, but it'll be in my next episode. It'll be perfectly fine. Um, it's a little bit larger version of my normal small hubble, which is 2x3, I think. 2x3, which is like the perfect starting house, starting out house, which is just perfect. It's just perfect. I mean, it's the first house you make. It's like a hovel. It's perfectly fine. Yeah, that was a pretty big tree. <laughs> I love the forestry mod. It's the best. Yeah, Arboretum. That's what I wanted. And I realized I needed bronze and... No, I needed... I needed bronze and... What was the other one? Bronze. Well, you need bronze. You need the other one, whichever... Oh, what was it? It was bronze and brass. Bronze or brass. And I think... I don't think brass you can use for it. But bronze you can. Hold on. 